Hey guys, Steve Simpson here with Remax Exclusive Collection and Central Florida Property Management. Wanted to talk to you really quickly about some recent real estate rental scams uh, going on in Orlando, probably really across the country. Um, I know you guys are all sharp, uh, you'd never be taken by a scammer, but maybe you know someone who isn't as savvy as you are, you can pass this along to them. So the recent thing that's been going on is you'll have scammers who will basically take an existing rental listing on one of the major sites, Trulia, Zillow, Hotpad's one of those guys, and they'll make a copy of the listing and move the address over uh, you know, a few spots and cut the price dramatically. So a place that would usually go for you know, $1,500 a month, they'll put for $1,000 a month. And they'll say, you know, act quickly, I just had to move, or they'll have some reason for doing it. Um, they'll almost always only contact you uh, via email. They won't talk to you on the phone. I've heard of a few that'll do the phone, but most of them will mostly do the email, email only. So uh, what you want to look out for, and what they'll basically tell you is, you know, uh, I can't let you in the property right now because I'm not there. Uh, you know, send me the security deposit and first month's rent, and I'll send you and I'll send you a lease. I'll be signing a lease, and I'll I'll send you the keys. Well, they don't own the property. They don't have the keys. They're just going to take your money. Um, you know, things to look out for, obviously, is if they can't meet you at the property to let you in the property, it's probably a scam. If it sounds too good to be true, it probably is probably a scam. If a house that next door rents for two grand a month and this one's running for 1200 it's probably a reason why. Uh, if they won't talk to you on the phone, again, probably a reason, uh, you know, why they don't want you to be able to trace the phone to them. I guess email addresses are, you know, uh, more anonymous. So um, just look out for that. You know, if something's too good to be true, it probably is. If you guys see one of these uh, that you're interested in and, and you know, you want to ask me if I think it's a scam or not uh, or really talk to me about anything real estate related, please feel free to give me a call. Uh, please leave comments at the bottom here. Um, hope you guys are all doing well, having a good uh, start to your summer, and I will talk to you soon. Thanks.